An amateur jockey rides horses in races exactly the same as an apprentice or a professional jockey would. There's no difference between that. We still have to do everything and ride under the rules of racing still. All the stick rules, all the other rules that apply to jockeys apply to us. The main pure difference is the fact that we just don't get paid to do it. A lot of people use the amateur sort of as a start off point to become a jockey. An amateur jockey is somebody that does it for the pure love of it. To be an amateur you do have to have another job because you have to financially be able to sustain yourself and look after yourself and do everything. So my primary job is an assistant trainer to my dad and a head, head girl as well. I drive the horse box to the races and saddle the horse up and do all the jobs that he does if he's not there and just generally work in the yard like you've just seen me riding out. I ride out three lots every day so just general work. I was happy with the way she's moving though, she felt good straight, moved where I wanted her to. It's not always the best job in the world, it's great when it's like today and it's sunny and it's, you know, you can really enjoy yourself out there and but then there's the middle of winter when it's not nice and you just need to definitely love the game to do it, you know, you need to love these guys a lot. <laughs> and now just keep her nice and relaxed and ask her to pull up nicely. She's done her job now, good girl. You know, riding a winner for your, for your dad has got to be up there with the top moments. Riding my first winner was, was a big deal. But even just riding a horse out and looking after a horse and it then going on to win, even if it's a tiny race, you've got it there, you've got it ready, you've done the job. And I always think that's, that's the thing for me that doesn't get enough publicity, is the lads in the yard that have spent all their hours working hard to get that horse ready and then get it to win. There is no better feeling than watching your horse. I suppose it's the same as a, for a trainer, like somebody who trains Olympic athletes, for them to go and win a medal at the thing. It's, it's emotional because you help them get there. If you enjoy the outdoors, it's definitely something worth going and having a look at. You know, even if you just go to a yard for a your six weeks holiday and go and you know muck out and learn a bit about it that's probably the best thing to do the other thing is uh, schools should offer courses at the British Racing School uh, where you can go up there for nine weeks and learn all about racing specifically racing but you know in your holidays or the weekends go to a riding school ask them to you want to learn just be interested and people are more than willing to help you get into this job if you're really interested <laughs>